Welcome to the Burbank Experience. My name is Austin. Today I'm reviewing Dusty Old Forester. As you can see, I'm not at my normal location. The reason being, I'm on vacation in Hawaii, so if the uh, quality is not as good, that's why, but the backdrop should make up for that, I hope. Um, so out in Hawaii, <clears throat> on vacation, Today's the 4th of July, been drinking a bunch of different stuff, but brought some samples and I brought an Old Forester bottle and bond that's from 1982. Now, if you've seen, I've done a lot of dusty reviews in the past and I'll continue to do dusty reviews. I, I really like just bourbon of, uh, of yesteryear. This one I only have a sample of. Um, but I'm looking forward to, I've been looking forward to this one for a while because I haven't had any old, uh, dusty old forester. I've had dusty heaven Hill, dusty medley. If you saw my video about the old Ezra 15 year, that's actually medley distillate. It's not heaven Hill, which also makes sense. Cause I, I said it had the strawberry jam thing that heaven Hill doesn't normally have. So that would make sense. Uh, but back to this one. So I've, I've had heaven Hill medley Turkey. Um, probably some like 90s. Oh, definitely some 90s Buffalo Trace stuff. But no, no old old Forester stuff. So excited to get into that and see if the flavors of today are similar to the ones um, from the past. Ooh, that's really good. That's uh, it's kind of lighter on the nose, but it's bottled and bond. So 100 proof, bonded warehouse, at least four years old. One comes from one distillery during one distilling season in a bonded warehouse. So that old Forster fruity thing is in there. Like I'm getting kind of a maraschino cherry cocktail cherry thing. There is, it's not like a dusty funk like I get on Turkey and Heavy Heaven Hill, but there is like a dusty thing. It just, it's, it smells thicker than current Hunter proof old Forester stuff. Yeah, maybe a little bit of orange cherry for sure that dusty thing really pleasant there's nothing nothing negative at all on this oh that's incredible okay so it has this mouth coating cherry cocktail or cocktail cherry syrup thing it just coats the mouth it has the dusty thing it does have that cherry the spice level is really nice though. Like, there's a nice spice that carries all the way through. Yeah, maybe a little bit of like a brown foreman banana thing. I'd say it's pretty comparable to modern day Old Forester. However, this doesn't have any of like the sharp edges that maybe Old Forester has right now. And the spice is really nice. I'd say it, it it's thicker, it has like this thickness to it. The spice level is nice. Um, some old Forester can drink hot, even if it's a lower proof or like their barrel proof, um, single barrels can drink hot for no reason necessarily. Like it doesn't always translate to more flavor. This drinks less hot as like a current hundred proof offering, but more robust, more flavor and just cocktail goodness. I would say <clears throat> the difference isn't as drastic as Heaven Hill and Wild Turkey. If you gave me this, this and said, oh, this is um, Old Forester, I would say, wow, that's a really good Old Forester product. Um, maybe the banana is a little bit less on this one than, than current offerings, but yeah. And then like your caramel and there, actually the more I know is that now there is like this funky oak that's starting to come in, which is what you always look for in Dusty's. Yeah, that's great. I can see why people don't overpay for dusty old Forester. And maybe, maybe it's just this one, but it's very good, but it's still, it's not drastically different than today's offerings. It's very nice. I like it a lot. I probably prefer this over current stuff, but um, the difference isn't as obvious with, as it is with Turkey and uh, Heaven Hill and stuff, but that's where I'm gonna leave this. I'm gonna shoot my next review right now and then get back into uh, back into the festivities of 4th of July in Hawaii. 
So as always, the bourbon experience is all about good pours and great times with whoever you're with. Whiskey's meant to be enjoyed, so crack those bottles. Cheers.